Greetings, welcome back to more, uh, let's play Illusion of Gaia Blind. I almost said Legend of Legea for some reason. Um, okay, so last time we, uh, got the crystal balls, is 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 is, and we defeated the boss on the first try, which was nice. And now we, we've arrived here, uh, which hopefully is not going to be, like, too much of a pain. Uh, what? A sign of life from the left-hand room. Am I supposed to just follow the signs of life? Uh, what is this place? Dark and lonely. Mother, save me. Okay, so I gotta find a way to, uh, to rescue my peepsicles. My peepses. You know, that last dungeon actually wasn't that bad. In the basement of the castle is a strange fountain. The stone is there. Hurry, hurry. Okay. It was, um, like, it wasn't, like, a great dungeon, but... I do, like, I can appreciate, like, the effort. Like, they try to make it, like, different from the other dungeons. Like, it was, like, some cre- Like, they- There was an attempt at creativity. In it. Okay, so not sure if we're gonna have to go back down there at some point. Uh, hi. Hey, you scared me. I practically had a heart attack. I saw Eric in the other room, but something strange. His body is half transparent. I can see through it. And he seems to be unconscious, as if his spirit is lost. Let's stick together. We don't know what will happen. Uh, I'll borrow Will's pocket for a while. Oops. I'm guessing it said that Lily joined me in my pocket. All right. Okay, so now I just got to figure out where to go. Uh, this is the way I just was at. God dang it. Uh, how mazy is this freaking place going to be, I wonder? Okay, right hand room. Did I not, did I not go this way? Apparently I did not. Uh, Red Jewel, noise. Uh, Will, where, where is it? Yeah, would you mind giving me a ghosty hand job? That'd be nice. I haven't gotten one of those, uh, like ever. I guess the only downside is that my jizz would go through her face, right? Okay, so did I get any indication on where to go? Did I have to talk to Eric again? At least I know that I don't have to play the memory song. It's kind of weird. It's like you played it once. It served its purpose. Then you just lose it. Oh, hello. Apparently I just didn't go here. Oh, it's just a red jewel? No. I mean, that's nice, but... I'm looking for progress, more than anything. I guess having the song disappear is good in a sense, because then that means that it's like eliminated as an option for when I like can't figure out what to do. I have to like jump down? How do I get to the basement? Didn't it say something about the basement? I gotta, I gotta find the, uh, the fountain in the basement. Maybe I can get over to the right uh, side. And down. Did I try here? Maybe I didn't go here yet. Ooh, now we're like down further. What? I can hear a soft voice from somewhere. The purification stone in the castle. So there's just a stone that just fixes everything in the castle that's effed up. Oh my gosh, a whole nother area? Hopefully there won't be like 50 ways to go here. Oh my gosh. Is this actually gonna hurt me? Oh, we got actual enemies, all right. Yeah, that dude actually came after me, so I was like, he's probably a real enemy. Maybe this is gonna be like the mini in-between dungeon. Dungeon. What the hell was that? I didn't even see it till it was coming down. Like on top of me. Oh, there's shadows on the ground that indicate where they're gonna drop, all right. My god, this is gonna be a freaking maze, ain't it? 
Okay. I should get my bearings. Okay, so... Okay, so we have two choices from the start. Let's, uh, let's start with the left one. Oh man, how much of a pain is this gonna be? Uh, 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 uh. So everybody got effed up except me and Lily somehow. Huh, so if these enemies are regenning, does that mean we're not gonna get stuff for, uh, for killing all the dudes in an area? Or respawning, I mean, not regenning, jeez. Oh, Red Jewel, all right, nice. I had eight. So now I have nine, 10, 11, 12, 13. Okay, so I have enough for the next thing when I run into Homeboy uh, next time. Okay, did I go all the ways already? That was the Red Jewel. Wait, no, that was the Red Jewel. Yeah, this is actually not my strong suit. So just bear with me. Okay, I don't think I tried this way. Holy nuts. This is kind of cool looking. Okay, so I'll probably have to come here when I get the purification stone and probably chuck it in there, right? Now that, that, that thing is pretty dope looking actually. I'll, I'll give him uh, credit for that. There haven't been a lot of like cool graphical things in this game, but I'll give them I'll give them full points for that one. Okay, well it's a good th good thing I checked that last way. I thought I'd already been to all the places. I was just like checking because I knew that I'm like bad at this. That's why I double checked everywhere. I ended up finding another path. Okay, so open casket. Oh, I thought, thought we were going to... Lily speaks from his pocket. Isn't there a hole in the coffin? I bet I could I could get in through the hole. I better have a look. I was just about to say, I wonder if we're going to have to fight the thing that was in the open co uh, casket. Found a strange found a strange stone inside this coffin. This is just the purification stone? Oh, all right. Okay, so, like, are we almost already done with this area? Can't seem to open the lid. Wait a minute, isn't there a hole in this coffin? Maybe this one will just have a red jewel or something. Strange, there's a key fastened inside this coffin. No wonder it didn't open. Can I get the key? Do I have the key? Or was it the key to the coffin was just locked inside the coffin? Okay, so now I just have to remember how to get to the freaking. It was here, right? It was this one, right? All right. Uh, what? It's a strange fountain. Could there be a connection between this and the rock? I don't know. Let's ask uh, Dwayne Johnson next time we see him. Okay, throw, throw the egg inside. He raised the purification stone. The stone began to glow and disappeared into the spring. Okay, shouldn't it at least be the same color as it was in the inventory menu? Okay, boy, that took a long time. Okay, so everything's all purified and shit now, so we should be good, right? Everything looks the same. Oh, hello. Saved, thank you. I was brought to th this uh, palace from Frisia and changed to a demon. Lily speaks from his pocket. What, all the demons we saw before were human beings? Uh, I now know what it feels like to be close to death. Death is, death is terrifying. I wonder if the animals uh, we eat feel the same way I felt right before death. 
Okay, were there any more, uh, like, people to talk to? Oh, hello. Is there anything this way? Oh, there was... Oh, I thought there was two people here. But they're gone now. All right. Uh, we were labor traders arrested for the crime of buying and selling human beings. But the party officials sold us to a vampire. I can't believe it. Uh, okay, that's the red uh, jewel. Okay, so this place ain't too bad. Well, well, this is the result of being tempted by a beautiful woman. Hey, just like real life, right? A nice guy asked uh, me, and so I followed him. I don't trust men. Yeah, you shouldn't. You should just stay single and leave us alone. Um, okay, did I go this way? Oh. Uh, the man sleeping in this coffin is surely a vampire. They're plotting something. Okay, so I guess I just gotta go all the way back. A uh, vampire couple lives in the coffins. They weren't they weren't in there. Uh, they bring people here, turn them into demons, and use them for labor. Well, what are they gonna do if we don't if they don't they don't perform the labor? Kill them? Uh, this palace is connected to the land of Mu. The vampires are looking for something there. Alright. So we're working our way back up, it seems. We're almost changed into demons. I'm afraid what might have happened if you had come later. Oh, so they weren't transformed all the way yet? Okay, I feel like this first area is, like, more confusing. So if I'm gonna get lost, it's probably gonna be here. I overheard the vampire say something like the mystic statue can be found in Mu. Okay, let me go back. Okay, so I know that I checked all the paths up from here. Nothing there, all right. I just want to make sure I check everywhere, because I have a feeling that, like, the one person I need to talk to is going to be, like, in one of these, like, random-ass rooms. I could just, like, I could easily just, like, miss a room that has the one person I'm supposed to talk to to progress the story. Okay, empty. Uh, maybe we could seize the palace and live there together. You want to seize this palace? This place sucks. Why would you want to live here? Uh, what will we do? Desert it in the middle of the ocean. Yeah, exactly. Jeez. Okay, ruled that area out. Did I go this way already? I did not. I stole the key from the vampire woman. Here, take it. Oh my gosh. Boy, I almost didn't come this way. Like, I, I figured, like, I was like 99% sure that I had already been here, but I just did it anyway. I received the key to the seaside palace. All right. Okay, so I got the key, which I guess it's good to find the keys, because now when I find the locked door, I'll already have the key, but now I don't know where the locked door is. Is it all the way at, like, the entrance, I wonder? Oh my god, okay. I gotta get back up. Yeah, I just checked this, like, three seconds ago, right? All right. That's where I got the key from, all right. Okay, so it has to be in this direction, right? Okay, I already checked that. So it has to be this way, right? On the top floor of the uh, palace is a passageway leading to Moo. Okay, sure, why not? Oh, that I, uh, I need th to use the key at the at the place. It was in like the first room where I started. Okay, so that wasn't really a dungeon. I mean, it had some enemies and it had like some rooms, but 
It wasn't very dungeony. Yeah, it was this thing. Okay, use the key in a bubble. Uh, he tries using the key to the seaside palace. I guess if it's in a bubble, I guess it makes sense since it's like water themed. Uh, the phantom land of Moo lies ahead. Okay. Okay, in we go. Oh, this is just the passageway. I was about to say. Doesn't quite look like the way it was described. The passageway, I wonder if it goes clear to Moo. I don't know. Well, why don't you just like shut the hell up for a second and we'll find out. Ah, uh, Moo. Okay, apparently it does. I was about to say, where am I? Lily and I set foot on Moo. They'll probably welcome us after waking from a sleep of thousands of years. Like, what is up with these? These tortured looking dudes. They don't look they don't look like they're having a good time. Okay, real dungeon. Yay! I guess the good news about or the get the good news about having a um a dun like a dungeon and then another dungeon without getting a chance to go to the jewel guy. Is that I'll probably I might be able to get two uh jewel rewards. I'll have like tons of jewels to give to him. Wait, how many do I have? I have five. All right. Oh no! Is it gonna be like a water temple situation? No. Then again, it probably ain't gonna be that bad, right? Oops. I don't know. For some reason, I thought that was just like a puddle that I could like step on. Okay, let's take out all the dudes. Give them sweet upgrades. There's no attack power-ups. Or there's no attack... There's only attack power-ups. There's no... Uh, weapons or armor. So, like, uh... So, killing dudes is actually how you get stronger. Is this a doorway? Oh, I thought that was a doorway. I was about to say, look how hard that is to see. I could have easily not seen that. But I guess it's uh, nothing. All right. And these stone guys are going to be annoying. Oh man, and they have a multi-shot attack? Okay, so you just want to get the angle on them. You just don't want to hit them from like straight on. Okay. Assuming he shoots the thing if you don't hit him fast enough. Man, these faces are creepy. Alright. It is empty. No, but I activated a trap or something, maybe. Nope, just an empty chest. Nothing, alright. All right, just an empty chest. I mean, kind of a dick move, but okay. I guess you're allowed to put empty chests in your game if you want to be a dick. So what the hell is this thing? What is this? I got him almost freaking dead. Aw, oh, clutch. Are those more likely to drop if you're low on life, I wonder? dash into it oh it just it's a it's a pusher all right I guess it makes sense that it's a bubble I thought it was some sort of like energy like field or something I don't know some kind of shield or force field or something it looks like it doesn't it, it doesn't really look like a bubble it was just a bumper I wonder if that's gonna be incorporated somehow Okay. You guys are kind of annoying that you gotta wait before you can attack them. Oh 
man, that was close. I couldn't go up or down, so I was like, oh, geez. I'm probably not going to be able to dodge if he hits me straight on. All right. I haven't got any power-ups yet, I don't think. Uh, is the jewel guy gonna be in here? The hell? Room of Hope. Why is this here? Uh, I do not have a thing with which to place upon the pedestal in the Room of Hope, so I guess let's just leave. Oh man, god dang it, now I gotta remember that that thing exists? Hey, nice, more life. Can I pull the bubble? I can. Okay, I wonder if any Let's Players got like stuck on that. How do I get down there? Gotta pull on the thing. You know, one of the two things you can do to interact with stuff in this game. Man, I need to not be taking hits like that, man. Actually, I haven't, I haven't come across a place to heal yet in this dungeon. Oh man, so when he does the angry... When he does the angry attack, he, he uh, shoots in all directions. I had a feeling that was the case. But he shoots in, like, all the directions. Like, you gotta, like, get away from him in order to, like, dodge properly. I wonder if I should just take a death. I have three, uh, three lifes. But then again, I might be, like, so close to a transforming place where I get my life back. Oh, wait, it'll be on the map. Nope, I am not close to one. Also empty, all right. Oh, should I use an herb or should I just take a death? The hell? I gotta lure this guy out. Boy, this guy is annoyingly placed. Oh, god damn it. Okay, well, is it a full heal? It's not even a full friggin' heal. It only gives you five. Oh man, I don't know. I kind of wish it was more than that, but... Oh, I didn't even go this way. This is this connects to the other area that I was at a minute ago where I died, where that guy killed me. Oh, nice. Wait, that didn't give me that much. It only gave me, what, two and a half? Jesus. Okay, um... We can go this way. I guess we're going this way. Okay, nothing here? Are you sure? Are you sure, game? Is there really nothing here? I don't buy it. It's gotta be something here. Something's going on. This big old empty ass room. There's nothing here. Are you sure? Is there really nothing here? I don't know. I'm skeptical. Really, really nothing here? I kind of wish Psycho Dash was like more useful, considering how few uh, battle abilities we have. Uh, well, I've been thinking. It appears as if the treasure chest is in the exact spot where the line of vision between both of the statues cross. I wonder if this is supposed to mean something. Maybe not. 
Right. So that means that there's a hidden secret chest, like, right here. Uh, I found the statue of Hope. Okay. So somehow I knew what it was named. Was there a room with the same name? Okay, we don't have to spell it out that hard, but I guess I won't. I guess I shan't complain. I'd rather have it be too obvious than, like, too cryptic, I suppose. You would think that you'd be, like, super obvious with the shit early in the game and become more cryptic later. Instead of starting with the stupid stand on the tile, even though there's, like, no way that for you to know that. Oh, wait, how do I get back up, though? Oh, attack it, dur. I was like, I can pull it, but I can't push it. All right. Can't push it, but I can swing it. Swing at it and push it with that. All right, whatever. But you would think that they would put, like, the obvious stuff early in the game. If you want to get more cryptic later in the game, that's one thing. But they put the cryptic thing right at the start. It's a freaking dick move. A uh, statue containing hopes of moo people. I don't know how he would know that, but... All right. Strange whispers heard from somewhere. The sun god, Rama. Rama? The ocean holds a power. Wow, really? All that just to say that? Okay, if you say so. Oh, there's less water than before. Looks like we can explore. We can now explore new areas. All right, cool. Okay, so it's not a water temple situation. It's a lower it once. And it's open forever. And now you can just go to new places. All right, I'll take it. I don't think there I don't think there were any places where I could go down into the water from the place I came from, I don't think. Oh man, that was close. Okay, so there's that one. Is that the only one? We're like close to the entrance now, right? Was the entrance right here? Okay, so are we gonna have to lower the water a second time, I wonder? Oh, and we can go down here. Okay, so there are two places we can go down. I kinda wanna check the other one first, but I'm already here, so let's just go. Oh, there is another place we're gonna have to lower it. Okay, I gotta see if there's a pull thing somewhere. Okay, just check and make sure I can't pull the pillars. Oh, I need to find another stupid statue. Okay, so I have to probably go to the other place to get it. And then I have to remember to come back to here. Okay, fair enough. Man, it would freaking suck. If you, uh... Didn't, con like, if you went to the other place where you could go down into where the water was. And then you, like... You thought that whatever you had to do was in there. You didn't think to, like, go back further towards the entrance to find the second place where you can go down into where the water was. Hey, nice. I one-cycled them. Uh, well, I'm always... I'm always like, oh, what... Maybe I should have gone the other way, but it's like, well, I'm already here. Might as well just go the way I'm already going. Oh, and a heal. Nice. But I might as well transform while I'm here. Uh, well, I didn't know you were going to give me, like, extra attacks. That's why I was just, like, hitting the button. I was just going to, like, save. When the water is gone, you will discover the location of Ram Rama. Rama, King of Mu. All right. Man, I've skipped a lot of text uh, in this game. Well, I thought he was just going to heal me and save. That's why I was just like mashing the button. I didn't know I was skipping text that you're only going to be that you're only going to be able to see once. Uh, 
Uh, nothing up here. All right, cool. Okay, so if you hit them quick enough, you can actually get two swings on them. Okay, just don't touch that thing. All right. It's like a glowy chain chomp. Oh, you just stay out of range, you good. Wow, I almost ran into that guy. Is this a slide or something? That was a long shot. I was like, can I wake him up by poking him? But I guess you do, uh, you do, like, wake him up by, like, stabbing him uh, the first time or whatever. I was about to say, do I have to bump her up here? Alright, so they actually, they actually did implement it into the design of the dungeon. So that's actually kind of cool. Okay, so once I start clearing out rooms, I should start getting uh, power-ups, like, really quickly. Uh, let me just check the bottom of this place. I can go down this way, too. Okay, I have to remember that there's another path uh, up from that other place. And then we got switch situations. Oh, it lowered the spikes, but just for a moment. I have to go like this. Okay, or not. How come this, like, energy beam thing, like, doesn't count? Maybe I was just off a little bit? Yeah, that has to be it. There's not enough time. Oh, there is. All right. Uh, what the hell is that? You know, this dungeon ain't too bad. You have the little, um... Or the, you have the, the, uh... The water lowering mechanic to let you know that you're making progress through the dungeon. God dang it. I should just walk. If I'm running, I don't have enough time to, like, react. Am I gonna get a new thing here, I wonder, maybe? A new, uh, new ability. Alright. Uh, Psycho Slider can now be used. Is it going to let me slide up hills, I wonder? Only Young Will can use the Psycho Slider. You can now use the sliding attack to pass through small passageways. Oh, okay. Push the attack button when running. All right. Okay, Will's power is the Psycho Slider. Pass through narrow corridors using this power. Careful not to overlook the cracks in the cliff. Oh, you know what? Remember that place I saw at the very beginning? I bet that's like an exit. I bet I can slide through there. That's either an exit or that's like a secret. Let's see what it looks like. Oh, it just says... Okay, just hit the attack button while, uh, while, atta while running. You do get locked into the animation, and it does make his feet, like, look weird how he sticks his feet up like that, but... Okay, sliding attack acquired. Yay. Is it even an, an attack, I wonder? Or is it simply a mobility, like, plot 
thing, like, just to let you go to the next place. Oh man, this guy ain't dead. Yeah, we gotta take this guy out. Oh man, apparently it's an attack. I didn't even I didn't even mean to do that. Okay. I did it. And now I'm here. Yay. We're actually in an episode, so we're going to have to end it here. So next time we'll work our way through the rest of this dungeon and uh, defeat the boss, hopefully. And I guess there's really not like a whole lot of interesting stuff to say about like what's coming up. It's like, well, we're just going to follow the formula. So, um, so yeah, join me next time for formula following. So that is going to do it. Thank you very much for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.